Hi, Johnny Kaplan here with another Gadget Flow unboxing video in partnership with the Corey Group, an award-winning crowdfunding agency. So today's exciting product is this TikTok 3 kids smartwatch. Now this is a very exciting product for me because when I was a kid, if I had one of these, oh boy, what a fun I would have had. So this allows any kid to, to put on the watch and effectively have video calls, video messaging. Uh, most of the functions you have on a smartphone, sending texts and emojis and so on, um, but all very conveniently on their arm, on a watch, and of course you have all the parental controls, you have privacy controls and all the protections that a parent would need to make sure their kids are using this in the right way. So I'm super excited to be unboxing this. This is a product I wish I had when I was a child. Let's get stuck in. Just carefully open the box. Wow, that's a cool looking watch. And you can see almost looks like an Apple Watch. Not much difference, a, a nice geometrical square shape. Uh, you can clearly see the video camera above it here. First things first, I think we should read the manual. He's on. It comes with this uh, Velcro strap on the back here, so you can actually very easily put it on. I don't know why other watches don't use this. It's actually very simple. Nifty little device. This is very cool. You can see the, there's a little animation going on there right now, and this is a very, very clear resolution on the screen here. So the thing is with this device is not only is the design, the weight, the feel, the buttons, and the, the functionality uh, very good, but actually the user interface, the, the operating system that they've put inside the device is very clever and very intuitive. We're always trying to enhance our kids' life, protect them, but not give them things that they can that can be a detriment and that they can use in the wrong way. So the guys at TikTok have thought all this through. Joey Kai is actually the founder of TikTok Tech LLC. And he's been engaged in the manufacturing and sales of consumer electronic products for around 12 years now. He's a passionate creator and product designer and his foldable speaker design was actually included in Time Magazine's 50 Best Products of 2009. Three years ago, he found out that kids' smartwatch phones with a GPS locator were very popular in China, but they weren't that popular in the United States. And he was sure that American children needed it just as much as Chinese did. So he brought a few samples to test and realized that the interface and app for the original product had a very bad user experience. Joey had created his high-tech company. The company had successfully released four generations of this smartwatch. Unlike the competitors who hire third-party vendors to create the software and hardware, they do everything in-house and independently. They managed to create a powerful, highly technical cell phone in a small device. Connecting families is one of the main missions of TikTok. They give families the ability to stay connected through text messages, phone calls, and video calls. It really is a smart looking device. It works very fluidly. And we're gonna check out a few more of those features to see how they actually work. Some of the functions that you can see in here are video calling, so you can video call with the 53 contacts that you can store on the phone. You can connect with your parents. You can send text messages with emojis and animated GIFs. Um, you could actually spill a little bit of your drink on this and it wouldn't affect it because they've made it water resistant to make sure that kids can go out and play still and enjoy their time and not lose it because it's strapped to their arm and not a bulky smartphone that's in their pocket. This comes with a GPS locator. And this is an enhanced GPS locator that over the four generations of TikTok creating these watches, um, they've made it more accurate. Um, they've actually made the connectivity through a parent's smartphone. So you can download the app, you can connect to the GPS locator, you can locate your kid, and actually there's a history there. So if you want to go back and see where they've been, you want to retrace their steps, um, you want to keep in connectivity with them, this is a great way. TikTok 3 comes enhanced with reminders and alarms. So you think to yourself, 
What could a kid need a calendar for? I mean, he doesn't have any meetings set up. You know, many these days have to take medicine, they have to do their homework, they have to be reminded of extracurricular activities. You may just want to remind them to brush their teeth, but you want to interact with them in a new technological manner, one that they love, that they embrace, and one that they're used to, why not do it via their smartphone? Often kids were gonna get text messages in class, they're gonna receive calls, and they'll have their smartphone confiscated by the teacher, I'm sure, and this is not gonna end up in a happy child. They've put a do not disturb function on here to make sure that the kid or you can actually access this remotely and ensure that they're not disturbed at any crucial time when they need to be learning and they need to be focused on their studies. Plus, they have a strong US-based customer service team and on-site technicians to test and troubleshoot. Now, one further level of protection is that you can actually switch off the dialing pad. So you can actually block your child from having the ability to call outside numbers. They'd be able to call 911 in an emergency. They'd be able to call you in emergency. But you can actually stop them from receiving and making calls to strangers to know that they're protected at all times. So, very, very clever design. Uh, you actually insert a SIM card, a nano SIM card inside this, and you send your kids on their way, but you keep it safe, you keep it fun, and you turn your kids into these uh, new age spies, right? Who wouldn't want a video calling smartphone watch on their arm? I've dreamed of this since I was a kid. Why didn't they have it years ago? I really, really love this device. I recommend it. If you're looking for something new to buy your kid, you don't want to buy them a smartphone. You don't want to buy them an iPad where their head's going to be down consistently, but you actually want to buy them something they can take with them and you can keep in contact with them. You can make sure they're keeping safe and enjoying themselves and connecting with their friends.